and welcome to episode two of Project Whitney. In today's video, I am showing you a snippet of like a little ab circuit that I did at the end of a hit day. I'm actually starting with Whitney's old videos and working my way up to the newer ones. And actually some of her older hit workouts were um, sort of less focused on mini like bursts of different things and more sort of like um, 30 seconds on, 30 seconds off on the treadmill or the elliptical or the Stairmaster or things like that. So because it wasn't sort of like as interesting or exciting, I didn't bother filming that section. I just did the abs at the end. So I'll show you guys that. And I also want to show you some of the supplies or resources, I guess, that I purchased to aid in my Whitney Simmons transformation. So let's get into it. Now, did I need more Gymshark? No, but you know, whatever excuse to buy a few new little outfits, that's you know enough for me. So I got um, a pair of cropped um, black seamless leggings, and and then I got a, like a, a nice beat outfit. I'll I'll try all these on and show you guys at some point, and then like a, a new um, flex top and bottoms as well and I just also wanted to show you I got um, a new protein I haven't been taking protein for a while so I just got this vanilla one because I think it tastes better than chocolate because you can just like have it in smoothies and stuff and chocolate doesn't seem to go with as many things and I also got some pre-workout because I know Whitney takes pre-workout and protein and I just thought protein would be good to fuel my gains and pre-workout would be good because if I'm going to the gym five days a week like she does, honestly, some days after school when I'm just not feeling it, I'm going to need this baby. And I've used it a couple of times. It doesn't make me itchy and it does taste quite nice. So I'm happy with that. A few new little goodies. Project Whitney, here I come. Well, I love the color of these long geomesh leggings. The fit is really less than ideal, particularly around the glutes. I was, however, really impressed with the crop top and I loved how it crossed over at the back. I definitely get that in another color, but the leggings might need to go down a size. I have these pants in the full length edition, but I'm so glad I got them in the cropped because I love the fit and just the staple black color.
I was concerned about getting a flex set since a previous set that I had, just the material wasn't great quality, but I've got to say these new flex additions, the quality of the material is such better. It's so much softer. The waistband fits a whole heap better and I love the long straps of the crop top. However, would change out the bra inserts because for some reason they are smaller. If you guys are enjoying sort of seeing this transformation, if you will, during my Project Whitney uh, challenge, make sure that you hit the red button, subscribe so you can stay up to date with all my progress and updates and, you know, the tips and tricks that I'm learning along the way. And why don't you sort of join in it to, you know, with me together and we can just be part of this little awesome crew and comment below if you want to join Project Whitney and some of the steps that you are taking in order to get that you know Whitney glow. I uh, hope you guys have a fantastic week and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye guys.